most amazing information transfer systems in a cell. In volatile weight proteins are encoded in and decoded from strands of DNA. Starting out with these long, fragile, sticky strands of DNA, an amazing machine called an RNA polymerase zips down the strand, opens up the coils, and copies the DNA into another molecule called RNA. The RNA uses a slightly different language convention. It still has four letters like DNA, but instead of A, C, G, and T, it has A, C, G, and U. The RNA then leaves the nucleus, and another amazing machine attaches to it. It's called a ribosome, and it is in charge of translating from the language of the RNA with its four letter bases to the language of proteins with their 20 different amino acids. Three bases on the bottom of the tRNA match to three letter groups in the RNA. On the other end are amino acids which pop off as they're attached to the growing protein strand. But the process isn't finished because most proteins need help folding properly. And that's facilitated by little molecules called chaperones. They attach to and protect the unfolded protein as it's transported to a watermelon shaped molecule called a chaperonin, which folds the protein into its final form. From DNA to protein, it's an incredibly complex process that uses precise and complex machines to translate between two completely unrelated languages, the linear code of the DNA world to the three-dimensional code of the protein world.